Hello everyone, this is CypherDeck, and today we are back in Space Engineers. So I've been doing some searching. Uh, you may be wondering why I'm on this cliff. It's because, well, I got ran up a tree whenever I was um, uh, out here. I was waiting for daylight before I started recording. Um, okay, there we go. That's dead. And the, I hopefully I didn't move too far away. <laughs> I, was, I mean, I fought to hold down this location uh, specifically for... Um, oh, actually, we need to get a robot before I go and worry about things and such. Yeah, you're good. Um, let's press G to follow. Down here. You good, buddy? Whoa, nice jump. Nice jump. We found carbon. Oh, jeez. Such a bad aim, but we need to get these, these vermin out of here for me to... Well, I guess I don't need to kill them. I can just place my guy on that carbon over there. But I would rather it get... All right. Get it, get on it, get on it, boy. <laughs> By the way, I'm gonna start calling him Bleeblorp. Uh, I I'm I'm not gonna change his name again because it just doesn't uh, stay. It's still again in early access, but whenever he, he gets near me, he does the um the R two D two noises like. So I'm just gonna call him Bleeblorp. Bleeblorp, save me, buddy. Hit him in the eye. Let's take a look at this guy before he goes under the ground. So I'm guessing this is his eye section here. Um, okay. And he kind of has a stingray look to him. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and set up um, Blee Blorp. Hey, buddy. Um, we're going to go ahead and press in. And we're going to make it a big bubble around that get that car get that carbon get that get that carbon blue blur all right whoa 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 <laughs> let's see if he goes back to um Okay, looks like he's going back to mining. Okay, so let's take a look at where I'm at. I'm at 21.12. Or, I'm sorry, 2.5.12. So, yeah. So what I think I'm going to start doing, I'm going to go pick it up in a little bit. I'm going to get my inflatable. And whenever I plan to come out on expeditions like this, just keep telling me you're going past me. All right, so he knows where he's going. Um, can you get out of here? Please tell me you can get up that. Um, please tell me you're not stuck. I'm going to look away. I'm going to look away. Let him do what he's doing. Look away. Kill me. Can't get up that? I don't have stuff to make a beacon. <clears throat> Should have brought stuff to make a beacon. I can't believe. Uh, because what I would do is I'd just go ahead and put a depository right here. And have him... Oh, he made it! <laughs> it took him forever. But he made it. Okay, so that's, that's fine and good. So... Today, what I'm going to be looking for is chlorine, but also I've heard several different things, been looking things up about the game, and um, apparently there is a mine in the game. I'm going to try to find it. Um, don't know where it is exactly, but hopefully we will um, we'll, we'll catch our, our drift on it. Is that plutonium? It looks a little bit brighter than what I remember. Either way, um, we're going to go ahead and take a look at it. 
one thing I think I'm going to start doing is beacons. I'm going to start bringing enough stuff out for beacons, depositories, and all of that. That said, that's going to be hard because of the fact our robot is now stuck on a tree. Get around. Hey, hey. There you go. There you go. Oh my goodness. I gotta baby him the whole way. I'm, I'm not even gonna look at him. I just want... Oh. Is this the mine? How did I find the mine? I was just looking at that. That is a different ore. Okay. Where am I at? Oh, that's not gonna tell me where I'm at. Um, I am at 1.69.5. How did I even find this? Lithium. Okay. I need to I need to get stuff. I need to get stuff before we go down here. I mean, we'll we'll take a look. Um and see what's down here. Hopefully we won't get lost. Hopefully there's no underground creature things. Oh, whoa. It got dark fast. For real? <laughs> it got dark so fast. Um, we're not going to go too far into it. We're just going to take a look. What's in here. See how diverse this uh, this place is. Um, showing lead on the roof. Titanium. Oh my god. Wait a minute. Am I seeing through the ground? Or is that in here with us? I I can't tell what is here and what is not here. That looks like it's in here with us. Why is it flying? That's a tumbo. But why is it in here? And why is it not on the ground? Hey tumbo. Buddy. Uh-oh, uh, he's turning. Is it coming for us? Uh, there's copper down here. Hey. Hey. No need to attack me. I'm, I'm a good guy. Um, copper. Like, all over copper. Um, going really slow here. <laughs> I'm trying not to, um, not to, Tumbo's still up there, and I found iron there, okay, just going through nice and slow, just trying to make sure we don't, okay, wait a minute, there's turnoffs, there's turnoffs down here. Um, okay. <laughs> We're going back. <laughs> We're going back. I need things before we start trying to take on this endeavor. Um, Tumbo, I, I don't want to kill you. Okay, he's coming at me. I hear a sound from him. He doesn't like me. Um, he can't hit him. Does that mean he can't hit me? I'm going to say yes. I'm going to say yes. He cannot hit me. Um, and we're just going to pass on through. Uh, go ahead and put this away. Move through here pretty fast. want to get out of this cave as soon as possible. I'm freaking out. <laughs> okay, so we found the cave. Uh, oh my goodness. And it just got even worse. But hey, at least it's, um, we're back in the daytime. Okay, how do I get out of here? I haven't seen a notification if my guy made it. Oh, geez, what's... Seen movement. Or maybe I'm not... Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, buddy. Whoa, whoa, gee, hey, hey. Whoa, you're right on me. Whoa, yay, yay, yay. 
Guessing you're not the only one. Okay. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> that scared, that scared the heck out of me. Okay. Um. Okay. All right. All right. I'm hearing noises all over the place. Uh, if they can get to me, I can't tell. Um, is there another cave in here? Or is this just a uh, an open area that I can get into? Okay. This is kind of a safe place, I think. All right. I'm going to go ahead and um, mine a little bit of this. See how heavy it is. Okay. Mine four. Let's see. It looks like 2.64 kilograms for four of them. We're, we're, let's go ahead and mine the rest of this. Again, we want to keep one. Oh, hey. Oh, he was. He was trying to get at me. I hate to hit you, buddy. But I can't let a Goliath like you hit, uh, hit me. Sorry, buddy. Alright, so let's go ahead and pick that up. We'll finish um, harvesting this. See how much we weigh after all of this stuff. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Alright, we'll leave that one. That way we have our notification... This uh, doesn't weigh that much, actually. We're only at 40 of, of 80. All right, so I'm going to let the weather pass by. Um, by the way, where those are right there, that is where um, our guy is supposed to be um, harvesting from. Still no notification on him. I don't know if he is getting stuck on trees somewhere. But definitely going to make sure when I come back that I come back with crates or the resources to make them. Actually, I could have probably made it with what I have. No, I could not have. <laughs> All right. Either way, I'll be back. Okay, so I'm back at my home. Um, and I, I was looking at the materials that I need to be able to make beacons. Um, it's these two items plus plutonium. So I'll need to put plutonium on my uh, robot in its inventory. But I did not know I found chlorine somewhere. So I'm going to go ahead and put this in my inventory and this. Oh, we need carbon, which he did harvest. Um, by the way, he is back with me. Uh, so that means I need to go back and get carbon. But, um, here, let's make him stay. Okay, thank you so much, buddy. You're good. All right. Okay. All right. Let's see what's in here. We need plastic. Are you kidding me? I didn't need chlorine. You just need hydrogen. Just need hydrogen, chlorine to make rubber, but I don't need that because I found rubber trees. What else is chlorine used for? Hydrochloric acid. Um, okay. Anyway, apparently all I need is hydrogen and carbon. And it takes one carbon and 50 hydrogen per So I need to make a lot of barrels, apparently, and just get a lot of hydrogen. All right, and a lot of... Okay, so let's go ahead and go out here. Apparently, it lets me just go out fine, but has to... Um... All right, so put these in there. Uh, let's see, how do I make... I'm guessing it's utilities, was it? Nope. No, how do I make? All right, I thought there was. Um, don't we make barrels in this thing? 
Thank you. Wait a minute. Can I, I thought we made containers in here. It's the forge. It's the forge, guys. <laughs> I'm so smart. Okay, so barrels. All we need is copper and steel. Do we have any copper? If we did, it's probably not in this crate. It's probably in the one over that way. Okay. Oh, we do have copper. Yay. So, what was it? Copper and steel? And we need probably as many as we can make. Um... And then we need the carbon. But we know where carbon is now. Because we know where the mine is. The mine is a whole other situation for me. It's going to probably freak me out. So, um... Four, five. I'm going to have to make more steel anyway. So I'm going to use as, uh, as many as I can. Okay, there we go. We're just a little bit over... Overburden. And then we'll go over here. And we'll fill these up. And then all we have to do is worry about carbon. So what I'll do is I'll, uh, once I go get the carbon, I will be back. So this is interesting. Uh, maybe I just didn't see it last time. But here is our hydrogen resource. And here's carbon. So... We don't have to travel so far to get our carbon anymore. Um, let's go in here. And I'm going to go ahead. I need to reorder these anyway. Um, put that there. Put this. Like at eight. And then we'll put three of these in our inventory. So five. And you can see there's a zero of a hundred. Uh, listed there you can even right click to see it and all we have to do is click on this and we can watch it go up once it goes to 100% then we go to the next one get that one of course we'll probably get attacked at some point but this is just right around the corner from our home so we then go into here with these Back into our inventory, move these onto our hot bars. And we have the carbon right here, so um, we can actually go ahead and start making the items that we need to be able to make vehicles. This is the most important thing for me, is I want to be able to make vehicles, uh, but we also need to make other things so that we can, well, survive. All right, so that is all good. Let's go ahead and get some mining done on this carbon. Not all of it, of course, because we want to send a robot over here um, to harvest it. Carbon should be very, very light, so we sh should not have any problems with uh, carry capacity. I mean, we do have hydrogen um, barrels. Uh, in our inventory How much did that pick up? I almost picked up 50 So let's get I think it's one One carbon per 50 Hydrogen There's 50 hydrogen per barrel Or there's 100 hydrogen per barrel So yeah um, Alright I was so happy that I don't have to Go so far for carbon but I think I'm going to start putting down beacons. The problem is, is that the beacons, you can't name them. And I'm guessing that's something that will be coming up later on. But I'm going to have to write down what beacons go to where. That way I can always just go straight to those locations. Um, but once we have our vehicles, uh, that is, should be uh, changing a lot for us. Allowing us to travel, plus... Um, Hopefully the vehicles are like the our robot that it has um that it has uh 
cargo, cargo capacity is what I'm trying to say. Alright, so let's go in here. Oh, we have one more hydrogen. Oh, hey, hey, hey. How's it going? Let's go in here, and we also have this one. Everything else should be good for right now. Yes, I know. I am encumbered. Once you come into here, and you're in an oxygenated area, you should be able to take off your helmet. I think. By the way, oh yeah, we can't even look at ourselves. Alright. So, I'm going to go ahead and take... Put these in here. Because I heard there was a bug with this. That it would take um, all of the hydrogen. Or it would um, misappropriate or miss calculate what hydrogen goes to what uh, or something along those lines so rather not worry about that we should be able to make two plastic per one barrel okay inventory two plastic out of one barrel there it is so let's go ahead and put this barrel in Okay, I don't know why I clicked three times, but put that in there. One, two. And we can continue to make this now. It's not it's not gonna be a problem anymore, so I'm I'm happy about that. Just Having the ability to make these is um, going to allow us to advance to the next step. So, um, trying to think of what we'll, we'll make next, but I guess we'll have to de uh, depend that or um, wait for that depending on what kind of resources we have versus what we need and, and so on. So, yeah. But at least we'll have some plastic, and it's not a lot of plastic, it's it's just what we need for now. And um, we're going to be able to at least have some barrels to refill, and uh, that's the main, main point. Okay, so we're going to keep these in here, and I'll go ahead and put the carbon in there because it needs to be there in, anyway. Now, then, let's go ahead and take a look at structures. Um... This is the structure I want to make next. It requires diamond. Hopefully we can find that in the mine. Circuit boards. Circuit boards are something that we'll have to... Okay, what is the next utilities or furniture? Fabricator. We can make a fabricator now because of the fact that we were able to make the plastic. Okay, so I guess that's the next thing that we're going to make. Um, let me go ahead and get the aluminum and all of that. And get the glass and steel. And um, we'll go ahead and get that started. Okay, so we are back. And I went ahead and got everything that we need for the assembler. Went ahead and changed one of these walls uh, from a glass to this normal block. Just because I don't know if there's more things that we're going to need to add into this room specifically. And I'd rather just have one available. I think if we are able to attach anything, I'm going to go ahead and put it over here. It's saying that the next thing I need to build is an oxygenator, but we'll, we'll worry about that in a moment. So let's go ahead and go into here. We're going to go to um, furniture. This is the next thing it's wanting me to make. It doesn't seem... Well, I guess we'll figure out <laughs> what it takes to make circuit boards and wire. But it doesn't seem like it's a lot that it's requiring. Only three wire, only one circuit board. But anyway, we're going to go ahead and throw down our fabricator. It doesn't look like I can rotate it. Um, so we're going to go ahead and just click um, F and hold it. there we go we have a fabricator let's go ahead and take a look so here's wire it takes copper gold and rubber now gold i kind of expected i know where to get it i think i think rubber is easy to get we have a lot of that so that is not a problem 
Oh, circuit boards takes lithium, gold, and plastic. So gold looks like it's going to play a bigger part than what it did prior. Then we have these uh, glass containers. A dark gun. I don't want to make that. A special weapon that fires a projectile to stun enemies and also tame creatures? Is that in the game yet? I know that we can make the darts and now we can make the gun. Is that even a thing yet? Um, that would be pretty amazing. Colossus, here I come. <laughs> um, so, okay. That's all good and well. Uh, gold and rubber. Let's see if we have the gold out here or if it's in the other box. Hey, buddy. You doing good? Um, I'll keep my depository safe. All right. So, copper, titanium. Here's our lithium that we got. Um, I went ahead and grabbed some plutonium as well. That way we can make beacons. We need uh, steel and glass and, um, and plutonium to make beacons. Don't know how much. Uh, let's go ahead and get this stuff out of our inventory. That didn't take very much plastic either. Um, so that's a good thing. But I think we're going to go ahead and get all the resources next time to make the oxygenator. But to be honest, we could skip the oxygenator and go straight to this. We just have to find diamond. Um, and we need a lot of gold. So that is something that we're going to work on next time. Hopefully you enjoyed. This is Cypher Deck. Peace out. Mm -hmm.